beach. Yeah, let's read The Beach by Bluey. I'll lift the flat book. Bluey, Bingo, Mum and Dad are off to the beach. Look at them. They're going to the beach. They're on a skateboard. skateboard. And look, they said beach. They set up the tent, roll around in the sand, and then race to the water. Bluey and Bingo pretend the waves are trying to splash them. Look, there's a wave coming, and they say, and the book says, "Here comes a big one." Mum is off for a walk along the beach. Why do you like walking by yourself? Asks Bluey. I'm not sure, says Mum. I just do. See you soon, little mermaid. What a strange answer, thinks Bluey. Not long after, she finds a beautiful shell and asks to show Mum. All right, off you go, says Dad. For real life, says Bluey, all by myself. Dad nods. Just don't go in the water. See, look at the picture. Bluey finds a really beautiful shell. And she says, whoa, what a cool shell. And Bingo says, ooh. Bingo waves her hand over Bluey's mermaid tail. Did we skip a page? I think we skipped a page. Hold on. Oh no, on this page, look, they're, they're putting together Bluey's mermaid tail. See? And then here, see Bingo's, I mean Bluey's got the mermaid tail. And then Bingo waves her hand over Bluey's mermaid tail and she says, legs! And look at that. Bluey laughs! I am the mermaid who got her legs. So look, she's free to her legs from the sand. And she says, Woo! Mum is now a tiny orange speck. Where's mum? Yeah. Oh, there's the tiny orange speck. Hmm, Bluey frowns. Maybe I'll just stay here with you and dad. But Little Mermaid, you can follow Mum's footsteps, says Bingo. Oh yeah, Bluey grins, thanks. Bluey hops from one footprint to another. She runs and skips and does cartwheels in the sand until she comes across a flock of seagulls. Look, the seagulls. Um, please, can you please move? Bluey asks politely. A mermaid needs to get through. You want to lift the flap? Yeah. It's a good thing mermaids aren't scared of seagulls. Ruff, ruff! See, look, Bluey runs and all the seagulls go flying away. See, you can see Bluey here. She's running and then she's skipping and then this is called a cartwheel. Bluey laughs as she hops from one footprint to another. She runs and skips and does cartwheels in the sand until a big wave sneaks up and crashes into the shore. It takes mum's footsteps out to sea. Oh no, the footsteps are gone. The footsteps are gone. They disappeared. See, there's still footsteps here. But the wave comes and then wipes out all the footprints. And I think in this picture, she's just either hopping or skipping. Ooh, you cheeky wave, Bluey Box. Hold on, hold on. How will I find Mum now? Just as Bluey begins to lose hope, she spots a... Pippi! Pippi coming for Wee Wee's. And then Bluey laughs. He 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 How does she laugh? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. A crab scuttles past. Bluey, hold on. We're not finished reading the... We're up to this picture. A crab scuttles past. Bluey copies its funny sideways walk. Hold on, hold on. Haha, I am the mermaid who 
got her crab legs. See, she's walking like a crab. Pinchy, pinchy, she says. Okay, now you can open it. Yeah, look at that. Look at all the crabs. Ah, Bluey says. Bluey scampers away. She runs and runs, then skids to a stop. A jellyfish, how will I get past? She picks up a stick and perks a blue blob. Perk, perk. It wobbles. Hello. Haha, -ha, you can't sting me, jellyfish. I am the mermaid who got her legs, but only for a day. Bluey races ahead. Look at this amazing shell, she calls, but Mum's still too far away to hear. Better keep going. What does she say there? She yeah. shouts, Mum! Bluey runs and skips and does cartwheels in the sand until she comes across an old castle. Perhaps this is where all the other mermaids lived, she thinks, and leaves her stick as a present. Ah, oh, there's a stick. We left it. Mm. Bluey left it. Yeah, Bluey left it. Then she slowly backs away and bumps right into a... Pelican! A pelican! Ah! Bluey begins to think she's had enough of walking by herself. She looks back at Dad, but he's just a tiny blue speck. If I can't go backwards and I can't go forwards, what am I going to do? Bluey remembers the seagulls and crabs and jellyfish. If she got past them, maybe she can get past a pelican too. She summons every bit of courage. After all, a little mermaid has got to be brave. Look at her. She's pumping her fist and says, I am the mermaid who got her legs, but only for a day. Then she tiptoes around the pelican. Scared. The pelican beats his, uh, beats his great big wings and flies away. Thank you for moving, Mr. Pelican. A familiar voice floats toward Bluey. She gasps and spins around. Mom! Bluey! <laughs> open the doors, open the doors. Oh, look at that. A big hug. Bluey holds the shell to Mum's ear. It has the whole beach inside it. Bluey and Mum head back together. I love walking by myself, says Bluey. Oh yeah, why is that? asks Mum. Bluey thinks. That's a hard question. There are almost too many reasons to say. I don't know. I just do. <laughs> the end. Do you want to read some more books? Yes. Okay. <laughs>